Hi, in this video I'm going to show how to replace the login page images uh, using an Acumatica customization project. So to start we'll need to have access to a local instance of Acumatica where you can access the instance folder. In my demonstration here my instance is called demo so I'm going to go into that folder so I'm in program files and then the Acumatica folder demo and then within, a, within that folder called icons is where we see these standard stock photos. So what I'd like to do is to be able to create a customization that contains these photos and be able to publish it on a different site. So let's get started and just a note that the instructions I'm using here were provided to me by Acumatica support so if you get stuck they can help. So the first thing I'm going to do is I am going to copy these photos that I've downloaded into a folder that I've created called Icons Customized. Okay, so this is very important to note. If we look at the stock photos, they are JPG files, and I need to make sure that I have the same name in my folder for these files. So I'm going to change this to 1, change this one to 2, all the way down to nine. So I need nine files in this folder. Okay, so now I'm ready to go into Acumatica and I'm going to create a new customization. I'm going to call it Login Page Images. I'm going to click Save. I'm going to click the link to open up the customization project. I'm going to go to files, add new record. So here are my files. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm going to hit save. Then I'm going to go to file, edit project XML. Each file is listed here. What I need to do is remove the word customized from this path and then add system file equals double quote true double quote. I'm going to copy this and then I'm going to add it to each line here. Okay, the next step is important. I'm going to click Save to Database. Now I'm going to validate the current project. Now I'm going to click Publish and I can anticipate that I may receive an error message. Okay, so in this case I did not, so I'm going to go ahead and close it, and I'm going to log out of Acumatica, and now you see my images here. So you may encounter an error message that has to do, at the time that you publish the customization, it'll say that some files have been modified in the file system. And if you receive that message, then this is what you need to do. You'll have to go into the customization project. Go into Files. And then click Detect Modified Files. And right now I don't have anything, but it would come up. And then you would click on Discard All Changes to resolve that error message. And that's it. Now, 
what I can do is because it is a customization I can export this out and then take this customization here and publish it to my client's site who is on SAS and we don't have a, a database or a folder access to their site. Thanks for watching.